I am not uncertain. They did for applications to have come in. Has gone. So Mr. Bradley did not put in his name, so as far as I'm concerned, that's it. So there won't be any uh, allowances for him to make a late entry? No, sir, not as far as I'm concerned. No, of course, I am not the party, but uh, in terms of my personal position, absolutely not. And I want to be clear, I don't have any indication that Mr. Bradley intends to ask for any sort of shifting of the dates to accommodate him. No, my knowledge is that he did not put in his name because he did not want to run again, and that's that. Sir, do you feel that perhaps Bradley's decision to not run again would perhaps kind of lower the possibility of UDP bringing in the police and Council's League? Look, considering that they're looking at new, me, new blood, new... Well, well, you're not really looking at new blood, which perhaps is a bit of a disadvantage. I don't know um, whether you want fresh faces or whether you want experience that's tried and true. But the two persons who have put in their name, both uh, Councillor Leslie and Councillor Willoughby, have been there for donkey's years. Councillor Leslie, I believe, topped the polls uh, in the two elections, I believe there were two, that he ran. So while I cannot in any way underestimate on the weight, the power of incumbents, and the fact that that might have been an added advantage that Mayor Bradley would have had. I believe we are in very good shape with the two declared candidates. And while the elections in the city will not be anything remotely approaching a clip war, I think we can 